Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 notification video. In this video, I would like to notify you that the second Easter egg is available for claim if you haven't uh, claimed it previously. So, if you haven't, then better get, go ahead and claim it. Uh, so, uh, then we have uh, an item available for the next 24 hours. Then what we're going to take a look at, we got the daily weekly challenges. Uh, well, I'll cover the daily because weekly or everybody already knows about them. Uh, then we're going to take a look at the daily ops, see what we're facing against, and I'll show you my rewards. Then, for those who did not know, uh, the event uh, for the Treasure Mall Miner is up and running. So uh, it's available until the 29th of March, and I'll show you my favorite route that I use when I play the game uh, in order to hunt and farm mole miners. <laughs> All right, so uh, let's start wasting time and jump right into it. All right, so in regards to the Atomic Shop, today we have the Meat Cooler Backpack. Now, have in mind that the Deathclaw, uh, this is not the Deathclaw uh, egg that you need, so I'm not sure why they haven't put it on the feature list, but anyway. Uh, in order to claim the second egg, you will need to navigate to the camp section and uh, just search through the entire list until you're actually going to find the next egg, which is the uh, patterned Deathclaw Easter egg. So that's what we have. And that's what I'm getting. So that's the the next egg. By the way, if you collect all of the eggs, uh, you will get a a bunny mascot as a helmet. So basically, have that in mind as well. All right. So that's uh, pretty much it in regards to the atomic shop. Let's go ahead and take a look at the daily challenges. So daily challenges uh, collect 250 caps. You can do that easily by selling something to the vendor. Complete uh, complete daily operation. That's what everybody does every day. Uh, complete an event, uh, do five daily challenges and uh, this will trigger automatically. Why did they change it back to five? Keep it at three already. Uh, kill a Deathclaw, Deathclaw you can kill at the Deathclaw Island, level up uh, one time, use a stim pack three times at nuclear winter, and visit your shelter. So for those who do not, do not know, the Deathclaw Island is uh, right here and it will scale to your level, have that in mind. Alright, so that's pretty much it in regards to the challenges. Daily Ops, we have the Burning Mind, Super Mutants, and Freezing Touch. Let's go and kick some booty over there. And afterwards, uh, I'll show you my route. Alright, so let's see what I get here. And... Script is good. Junk, junk, junk. Oh, oh, not bad. I actually already have the XL1 paint. But anyway, uh, but don't it supposed to drop other stuff? I mean, what the hell? Hold on a second, one sec. Yep, I already have it. Anyway, my favorite route starts at the, uh, where is it? Oh, there we go. Morgantown Airport. So over there, through the Morgan t entire Morgantown area, this is where I usually prefer to farm all of the treasure miners. So you will end up essentially appearing right here, right? Uh, let me switch my gun. Okay. Zoom out a little bit. All right. So man, I keep misclicking the sprint button because I've been uh, playing a lot of uh, what do you call it? Uh, state of DK2. So over here, if you're lucky, you'll be able to find uh, a treasure wall miner, and we do not hear him at the moment, which kind of sucks. Got a bad feeling that, because sometimes it ha it is the case that they don't appear, but through all the locations that I know, this is my favorite spot, and we still don't hear any of them. Uh, nope, nope. Nope. So, you might find as well some over here if you're lucky. Let's get the hell out of here. I'm not gonna waste any time. By the way, if you want to collect a hundred uh, pre war money, once you run in this area, you'll trigger this event. Uh, use that thing over there, and it will start the quest. You will need to kill five waves of Scorched, and uh, you'll the cargo bot will deliver 100 pre-war money, which you can scrap for cloth. Then you run this way, and if you're lucky, you'll get it uh, here as well, but today must probably ain't my day. 
Alright, so afterwards you turn around and run here. Make a little turn to the left. And if you're lucky, which we are not. Damn it, what the hell is wrong with this server, man? But if you look uh, to the video that I've made on this rally, you'll see, you'll see that I've encountered a maximum here like, I think 11 or 15 uh, treasure mole miners in one run. Then if you're lucky, you may find him appearing here, but not the case. Uh, check by the school as well. You can run around. If you hear the beep beep, then go ahead and kill him. In our case, we're just not lucky again. Damn it. <laughs> here we go another one and we should find somewhere over there but let me go ahead and uh, loot this guy so nothing here ah man I'm misclicking the sprint button alright do we hear any beep beep nope then you turn here uh, you run this way and not lucky again usually it pops with this guy as well I mean in this area right here oh we hear our cockroach somewhere right here this is another spot where we check where is he? is he on the bridge? boom hey our naughty sweet afterwards we run all the way over there Run in, run in, in, run in, run in. You should be lucky to find one here. If not, then nothing here. <laughs> also, just give it a shot and just run this way as well, just to double check. Nope. No more cockroaches. That kind of sucks. All right. Afterwards, we return back to that area over there, and we're gonna go ahead and run to. Uh, Greenhouse, ground. Oh man, I forgot the name of that damn building. What's the name of that? Bolton Green. Man, I misclicking the. N this is what you get when you play the game. Bolton Greens. There you go. For playing a lot of another game, it has total different set of controls. All right. Nope, not lucky. Check by the bus station. Sometimes you may find it over there. But this this one is very rare. Nope, nothing. Then you run through this way. Don't follow the road because uh, more spawns are n n off the road, so you'll be you'll have more luck getting one here. But again, we're not that super lucky in this run. Well, I would already ha would have restarted uh, the server. If I weren't to get like uh, by here, like four, then I would restart. All right, then we we'll check over here. We'll also spawn points. This is why I love Nuclear Winter. I know this place like so good now. And uh, when I decided to give the run a try, I was one of the very first to discover that this. Morgantown is one of the best locations for farming the treasure mole miners. And the final stop is inside the house. Unfortunately, it was not super lucky uh, in this route, but once, once again, if you will go to the guide videos that I created the playlist for and look up my route video for this one, you'll see uh, how many I've got. Well, basically, we don't hear no bait bait so that means there's nobody here but yeah this is the best route it's always been no matter how many times the event has come back and I don't think nothing has changed anyway we either find like what three three is good all right This is where I'm going to be calling it the end for this video, so I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So if you got something to say, feel free to comment. The only thing that I ask of you is not to swear. And by the way, those who are using cell phones to use, make sure you don't have 
a dot between two words because for some reason YouTube also uh, triggers on that thinking that you're trying to promote a link and they also become invisible. I do check my uh, comments on hold so I try to respond to them as soon as possible. I have that in mind as well. But if you want your comments to be read by other users, by myself and etc, just don't swear and you, you should be good. If you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Sol from Ukraine, so hi from Ukraine. If you want to join our Discord community, feel free to do so. The link is down in the video description. We're over 800 uh, members there. Make sure to read our rules, otherwise most probably you're going to get banned if you break it by me or by my mods, whichever comes. So. Thanks all for watching. You all have a good morning, day, and night. Whatever you guys lock like at, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye. From the ashes we rose into the future we'll go. We are the